Kim, there's Kim that are striking. Kim Kardashian apparently crossed the journalists' organization of America picket line to film the forthcoming Time of American Harrowing Tale. On May 31, WGA strike captain Warren Lee tweeted, Sorry to report that Kim Kardashian crossed our Midtown picket line today. In her chauffeured Escalade, she sped past us and into a freight elevator. Essayists aren't keeping up, however Kim crossed our line. He later added, Kardashian had leverage that she did not use, even though working actors are required to act until June 30, which means that she is not scabbing or, in her case, scabbing. We set up a line, she was driven past it into a holding up cargo lift, Lee told the everyday monster. The security guard of the building donned a bulletproof vest, which appeared excessive. Ryan Murphy, the creator of Oz, has contributed $1.7 million to a relief fund in support of the striking writers. Delicate is the title of the upcoming 12th season of Oz, which will be based on the novel of the same name by Danielle Valentine and brought to the bargaining table when fans unionized. According to The Hollywood Reporter, filming on the show has been taking place in New York City since April. The WGA recently shut down creation on the season on May 3, as per WGA part Caitlin Fontana. Vulture contacted Kardashian and FX for a response. If the reality star is a member of SAG, might she be seen posing in front of the strike's front lines? Kim Kardashian may be in the midst of a summer romance. According to Us Weekly, the single reality star has found a new partner. The source stated, Kim isn't dating anyone officially, but she's interested in someone. They have only had fleeting flings with one another thus far, but they have not yet committed. The source said that Kardashian is interested in pursuing things with this person, but did not specify who they were. The source continued, she wants to keep it under the radar for the time being. The source went on to say, she's not ready to be seen out on a date with anyone for the time being, because she doesn't want to make it a big deal. She knows whenever she's seen out on the town then things get dramatically overemphasized rapidly, yet there is someone unique she has her eye on, so she's amped up for where things could go. The news from us comes after Entertainment Tonight reported earlier this month on Kardashian's dating strategy. Kim is feeling great, and she is ready, open, and excited about dating in general, and the potential of finding a forever partner one day, a source told that publication on May 19. Pete Davidson was Kardashian's last public relationship. She explained why they broke up in August after nine months of dating on the Kardashian season premiere earlier this month. In an interview with Entertainment Tonight, she stated, We just had talks and talks, we'd been talking about it. So it's very much like the two of us simply imparting all around well about it. When you nine months, it is evidently sad. It seems like an eternity. I don't have any random relationships or hookups. She acknowledged that while she was dating Davidson, she experienced a lot of guilt because he went through a lot because of my relationship. Her remark refers to Davidson's very public harassment by her ex-husband Kenny West, which Davidson reportedly sought out trauma therapy for. Thanks for watching.